Lizzie Dumplings. Thank you for tuning in today. If you are new here, go ahead and leave a like and a comment down below. Subscribe to my channel. Um, welcome back, DDT gang. As you can tell by the title, what we're going to be getting into today. Um, I'm not going to hold y'all. I don't want this to be a our video um so we're just gonna jump right into it okay all right you guys so if you don't know i am um getting a surgery i'm getting a tummy tuck lipo 360 in the arms um lipo 60 lipo in the arms as well um my surgery is coming up real soon so if you didn't know you can go watch my previous videos um and tag along with me on my journey as you can tell by the title this is just my supplies of what i have um getting ready for my journey and yeah this is part one okay this is part one of the supplies and stuff that i have and that i'm going to be taking along with me um to the hotel for my journey whatever Okay, so we're going to start off with my, um, y'all, I love this purse. I got this purse from Sheen. This is my favorite purse. I use this purse for everything, but we're going to start off with my gummies and my vitamins and stuff like that. So I've already been taking, like, I am already was taking, like, drinking beetroot um, juice, like beetroot water, beetroot water and stuff like that. I've been taking prenatal pills every day. I've been, um, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's just something I do. Anyways, like prenatal pills, um, which is a multivitamin, and um, also my collagen gummies. So I've been doing that for a long time, you guys. I am a mother of four. And um, so I've been keeping myself, you know what I'm saying? I keep up with myself. I keep up with my health. So I'll, I be taking, the only reason why I be taking the prenatal vitamins is because they have all the vitamins and everything you need, a daily dose of everything that you need regardless and especially if you have a healthy diet if you eat good if you eat right like you won't be having no issues and no problems so um instead of taking four to five different pills each and every day no I only take a multivitamin uh, which is the prenatal pills and my collagen gummies and um turmeric sometimes i'll be sometime with the turmeric but um you guys so i was taking these nature made prenatal vitamins already you guys um i had to stop taking these um because once they sent me my paperwork of everything that i need to take um before surgery and stuff like that to prepare my body and stuff like that i was already taking prenatal pills so i had to stop and take those because those were multivitamins and the stuff that they requ they um requested for me to take they didn't want me to overdose which is, you know, which is fine. So I had to stop taking my prenatal vitamins and they recommended vitamin C. These are a thousand milligrams of vitamin C that I take each and every day. Um, I also, they also requested the folic acid. Um, I take these every single day. The folic acid and, where is it? They also requested the Floridex. So, one, let me tell y'all about this Floridex. Let me take it out of the box. The Floridex. So, this is how it looks. And you take this twice by mouth every 30 minutes before a meal. Um, some people say that you should be taking this like 30 days before your surgery or if you last minute, um, two weeks. Because this takes two weeks to get in your bloodstream and stuff like that. Um, let me tell y'all about my story with this. Um, I actually like booked my surgery on March 29th. My surgery day is April 18th. I received this like April 4th. My lab works, um, I had to go do my lab work on April 5th. So I only had 24 hours of using this in order to make sure my labs and stuff like that came back you know what i'm saying good and stuff so i took this on a four as soon as i received it twice that day and then that morning at 10 30 a.m i had to go do my lab work i took um i took this so my labs came back you guys i am cleared for surgery and um my hemoglobin 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 whatever the word is y'all know what i'm trying to say the stuff for your iron my levels was at a 13 and i don't think I don't think it's because of this because it's like, you know, like I said, I already was taking care of my body and I'm already healthy. So I feel like it was, you know what I'm saying? Once you have a good diet and you, you know, having the right vitamins and stuff in you, you're going to be good. So I, my, my was already at a 13. 
So I don't know, but as you can see, it's almost gone. I don't know if y'all can see like what's left in this bottle. I don't know if y'all can see it, but I have been taking it ever since and um, it's almost gone. It's, it tastes sweet. I like the taste of this. It's like juice. They say don't drink it out the bottle, but you know, you can't tell us nothing. You ain't telling me nothing. But yeah, um, this is filled with, um, this is a liquid form and vitamin, vitamin formula, iron. Um, it has a B12, B16, um, B2, and um, you know what I'm saying? It reduces tiredness and fatigue and stuff like that is basically for your iron and stuff so this is what i've been taking as well um i laid off the i laid off the collagen gummies for what reason i don't know i think it's because this is not something that they had recommended on the paper that they gave me but these are my gummies these are the gummies that i take these are the collagen and biotin gummies these are 100 milligram this is what i take this is what like on a regular like on a regular you know what i'm saying so this is what it take um the next thing oh oh like i mentioned before you guys um after my third child i've had like because i had i have four kids everything was natural everything was um natural i had my kids naturally and um no like no epidurals no morphine like no type of medicine and stuff like every time i made it to the hospital it was time for me to push the kids out you know what i'm saying so my body after my third child my body got out of whack and i started having like blood pressure problems and stuff like that but through the grace of god i'm so happy like i don't really had a problem but just to be on the safe side i had got went to cvs and got this called garlic you know as you can see, I'm going to leave everything in the description box below. And this is for healthy blood pressure formula. Got, it's 60 tablets in here. And this is made with vitamin C, folate, um, B6, B12, magnesium, and garlic powder. I don't know if you guys know, but you can look it up. Um, garlic is like an old school remedy that they use when you had high blood pressure and stuff like that to, you know, keep them stable and level and stuff. It is an old remedy and it still works to this day because my grandmother she was doing that because she had high blood pressure and she just used to eat a clove of garlic all the time so um i feel like that helps so much you know what i'm saying so this is what i've been using my levels was good everything has been good ever since then so i honestly i do recommend these um and speaking of high blood pressure y'all another alternative another thing that helps been helping me too is the beetroot powder um, I was taking this, like I mentioned before, I was taking this and my collagen gummies and my prenatal vitamins each and every day. It was like a ritual. So I was already taking care of my body and stuff like that about my health. We can go to war. But this is what I've been taking. This is another alternative. Like if you have high blood pressures and you don't want to take pills and you have a hard time taking pills and stuff like that. This is another alternative. Um, eat a lot of beetroot, drink beetroot juice. Um... I forgot the lady name. I think her name Ebony. Um, I watched her journey and she put me onto this and it's been helping ever since I think like two, two, three years ago. Um, and it's been good. It's been working and I really, I really need this. So that's that with that. Um, I also, for after surgery, I got my Tylenol extra strength, y'all. Got my Tylenol extra strength because I'm not trying to get addicted to none of the drugs that I'm going to be prescribed with. You already know how that go. And for those of you that already had surgery, you already know what you're getting prescribed and the perks and all of that stuff. Like, So, I got that. Also, so those are the vitamins and stuff like that. Um, moving on. Now, this is so ghetto because I ain't got the top on it. I just popped three of them things, you know what I'm saying? Um, but anyways, these are stool softeners. As you can see, these came from Amazon. I'm leaving it in the description box below, like I said before. Okay, so when you're taking a lot of vitamins, um, and if you have a slow metabolism to where you don't use the bathroom each and every day or throughout the day and stuff like that, you can go two, three days without using the bathroom, your colon is clogged, sis. You need to remove the bacteria, that food, the toxins, and all of that stuff. And um, I am speaking from experience because I have a slow metabolism. And 
it be taking me to i'll be i'll be using a bathroom or don't be having to do number two like two to three days you know what i'm saying so that isn't healthy and by me taking all these vitamins it'll get you constipated and get stuff clogged and stuff like that so this is a good alternative um stool softener i mean laxatives and stuff like that to like get you going and so you can your immune system you can just float freely and stuff like that so you won't have no issues and no problems or be backed up and stuff like that and wondering why you stuff coming through your skins and bumps all over your face and stuff y'all know what i'm y'all know what i'm getting at so this is what i got and this is what i've been taking um it have been working so far so can't complain it has been working so far besides that y'all i got um the moderma um these this is for like the scarring this is the old new um scars from moderma for injury burn surgery acne um cut marks this is the advanced plus moderna gel and this is what you use on your incision line after surgery to heal it and also fade it and stuff like that so got my handy dandy moderma you guys i also have the hyper cleanse this is something that you're going to need to use the day of surgery to take a bath in no no deodorant no lotions no nothing they um they prescribe you they prescribe you they request you to get the hyper cleanse it is a um antiseptic skin cleanser so i got that um for what for some reason i don't know why i thought i was getting a video but i got a urinal I thought I only bought one, but it came in a pack of four. Um, I got that. Um, I don't even know if I'm going to be using it. I have my Arnica gel, y'all. This is um for, like, bruising, muscle pain, stiffness, and swelling and stuff like that. This is, like, literally for after surgery. Um, If you've been bruised bad, if you got aggressive lipo and stuff like that, it is non-greasy it says fragrance free and it quickly absorbed so i got my arnica gel y'all and we're gonna talk about this these are heal fast surgical and injury support pre-op they got one bottle for pre-op what am i doing they got one bottle for pre-op heal fast and then they got a bottle for post-op so these two i've been doing my research on these i've been seeing a lot of good reviews about these even when i got these off amazon the reviews are phenomenal um for the pre-op this is used for um to keep you um this optimizes nutritional status prior to surgery this is for pre-op um i think it's like two three pills or something five pills so i didn't read it um, how many pills you're supposed to take the days before pre-op and this is for post-op and this is to keep um, this is to replenish key healing um nutrition and additional um ingredients to support post-surgery wellness i've heard a lot of great things about this you guys can do your own research about this um i'm gonna go along with you guys i mean you guys are gonna go along with me on my journey to see if this actually works and what's my um what's my review on these so yes i most definitely will be taking these i need to be taking these now because my post-op appointment is on the 15th so you got to take these i think five days before post-op so i need to start taking these um what else i have is a 360 light bulb is my 360 light bulb foam and compression board it came in this packing and this is also from Amazon. I don't know if you guys can see this. Also came from Amazon. And this is a lipo compression board, abdominal back compression board, lipo foams and board. A 360, you guys. So, of course, I'm getting lipo 360, you guys. And I'm also getting lipo in the arms and a tummy tuck. So, this is all in one. A three in one. This is how it looks how it looks and this is the like the band part that you wrap around and you just wrap it around your yourself you put this inside your bra and this right here is really hard can barely break it so i got this i also because we is on a budget sis like you know everybody don't have 150 dollars or 200 dollars like post after surgery to be booking you know what i'm saying that's why you have to be like financially you have to be prepared for surgery not just to pay for the surgery but the aftercare after surgery you know what i'm saying the aftercare after surgery you know what i'm saying so 
um in the meantime and in between time because for a fact after surgery it is crucial it is ideal for you to get 10 lymphatic massages 10 of them so my first week of post-op of surgery um i'm most definitely getting manually lymphatic drainage massages and then um i'm not even gonna lie to y'all i'm not gonna hold y'all I am going to be using my muscle roller stick. This is, a, this is a green muscle roller stick. Um, this is for, you know, the places I can reach. Um, I will be, it's, it's something to be honest. It's something more like, um, not only a help you, this is not only something like a substitute for the manual, um, lymphatic draining massages, but I feel like this is also a, um, substitute for like wood therapy as well, because the same way, I don't want to take it out of the box, but the same way it, I'm going to take it out of the box. All right. I'm not going to take it out of the box, but anyways, um, it, it has ridges on here. Look at me taking it out the box. It's crazy. Anyways, you see the ridges on here? So it's like a substitute for wood therapy and a substitute for manual drainage massages. So you won't get fibrosis because I'm am getting a 360 lipo. So this is to keep, you know what I'm saying, me um pushing the liquids and the fluids down um out of the drainage areas or pee it out or whatever the case may be. And y'all know. I'm not even gonna be playing. Like, I'm not even. I'm not in come to play. You know what I'm saying? Cause I know my pockets, and I know, I know my ways, and I know what I'm gonna be doing. I know what I'm not gonna be doing. So I'm gonna make sure this gonna come in handy every single day, every time I get in the shower and stuff like that. I'm gonna make sure I'm doing some type of massaging, self care at home. You know what I'm saying? To have the optimal results that I want. Cause I'm not. I'm not paid too much money. And what we're not going to do, we is not fit up this investment, okay? So, I also have my Keisha K. Your um, waist trainer. I will be waist training um, after surgery. I didn't have to pay for I paid for this like two, three years ago. I've been having this. I love this waist trainer. Um, so, this is my waist trainer I'm going to be using after surgery. And... I also have this gallon water bottle, you guys. Um, as you can see, it has insp little inspirational quotes on here. It's from 7 a.m. to 9 p.m. at night. It is a gallon, as you can see. It has a scroll in it. And um, because you have to, it's um crucial that you stay hydrated after surgery. Um and that such i just took this out of the pack and i haven't been using this exact bottle you know me the getaway i've just been literally been drinking out the jug like drinking a gallon of water a day but literally drinking it out the jug i should start using my bottle but i'm throwing the jug away anyways but anyways you guys so i got my my gallon um jug water bottle is um let's see what else am i missing something oh okay and then on top of that and then i have my um my scar removal silicone strips this is a two month supply you guys of the silicone strips that i have um it minimizes all type of scars um post-surgery c-section keloid stress marks tummy tuck incisions and um this is what i also will be using um for after surgery and you use this um six weeks on new, um after six weeks on new scars two to four months on old scars and um yeah what else oh and i went and got the little measuring tape so i can um keep up with my results on my journey continue to measure my ways continue to you know what i'm saying keep up with myself um i didn't have this i didn't have this before so i got my little measuring tape y'all um yeah that's all i got with me right now um you know i'm from i'm from here so i'm from here so so once i get to the hotel anything else that i am going to be like using or missing or anything like that it will be a part two to this so make sure you guys stay tuned and i will finish off where i left off i didn't want this to be a 30 minute video um so 
this is what I have right now. And once I get to the hotel and the little few other things that I need, I will make it a part two and I will let you guys know. So make sure you guys subscribe to my channel so you can be notified. Oh, click that post notification bell so you can be notified every time that I upload. And yeah, make sure you guys follow me on all my social media platforms. It's in the description box below, but I mainly be on Instagram. Follow your girl. But nah, for real, y'all. Um, thank you for tuning in. And if there's anyone out there that um that is getting any type of surgery, no matter what it is, tummy tuck, BBO, lipo, whatever, whatever, do you boo boo? Who cares what these people think? Who cares what these people say? And we gonna get into that in another video. So make sure y'all stay tuned, and I will see you guys in my next video. Uh -huh.